I'm awake, but I'm tired again. <sighs> what will I dream about this time? This needs cleaning, and this, and here, and there. Mr. Lucian's coughing seems to have improved. Such concentration. But I really should convince him to take a break now. I kept my promise. That's fantastic, Mr. Lucian! Okay, first I'll get him to bed, then I'll go for help. trying to help you. This is what you get for ignoring others' kindness. Since you refused my offers, I have no choice but to ask you to die now. That's my question. Who are you? There wasn't anyone else here a minute ago. I've been here the whole time, but you didn't pay attention to me until now. Why can he suddenly see me now? He could only see Mr. Lucian before. Is it because I'm carrying Mr. Lucian on my back? <laughs> Interesting. 
the knight in shining armor turns out to be nothing but a silly little girl. Don't underestimate me. I'm a future knight of Convalaria. What's a knight of Convalaria? Oh, I remember now. They're the jerks who destroyed the wonderful world I'd created. Your wonderful world? <laughs> if I hadn't been tricked by that modifier and trapped in this damned mirror, there's no way you would have been able to touch the paradise I created. Well, that's decided. Before I find the modifier, I'm going to kill each and every last one of you reformists. I have no idea what you're babbling on about, but Grandmother Colleen, Mr. Artisist, you cannot tarnish the names of these people who have given their all for Amorphis! Interesting. Very interesting. Listen well, minions. My strength has not yet fully recovered, so you're going to have to teach this brat a lesson for me. I don't care if I'm in a dream, but I'm not going to lose to the likes of you. All this prattle. I'll heal all your wounds. This will suffice. I'm not getting my hands dirty. Victory. Simple and boring. <laughs> What's wrong? I haven't even finished warming up yet. Curse you! Why are my attacks so slow? Why can't I keep up with him? Forgive me, Grandmother. I'm sorry, Mr. Lucian. If only I trained harder. If only I were a little stronger. I know you're just a sniveling little kid, but I have a feeling you're going to cause me a lot of headaches in the future if I let you go. Funny. I was just thinking the exact same thing. <laughs> it's almost cute how stubborn you are. Unfortunately, playtime's over. Over for you. Huh? What the? Ah! Mr. Lucian? Mr. Lucian! Are 
Why? But my body seems to repel them for some reason. I just have to touch them. And they go up in smoke like that. Crystalusian! <coughs> that one was much stronger than the one I encountered last time. <coughs> but judging from the looks of it, <coughs> it'll probably take a very long time to recover. It might even lose its memories, or go insane. Athena, do you remember the mission I entrusted to you? Of course. But if I leave you like this, I'll be worried. Our meeting is nothing more than a dream. And your help isn't going to change it, I'm afraid. But... Please make sure Colin receives my gift, so my soul may rest in peace. My fate has never smiled upon me. I've suffered from this illness ever since I was a child. <laughs> to tell the truth, it's a miracle that I've managed to live for so long. The other children at school never wanted to hang out with this sick kid. So I shut myself away in a room with just my imagination for company, waiting for death to finally come and claim me. But one day, somebody told me that the art I'd created could sweep away the darkness that had befallen Amorphis. And they brought me out of my isolation. I met someone who believed in me right when I was at my lowest point. When I was denounced and attacked, she drew her sword to protect me. They sacrificed their lives and their ideals so that I could speak. I never thought I'd be lucky enough to meet such an interesting, loyal group of friends, let alone have the chance to fight alongside them to make the world a better place. But we humans are never satisfied. I started thinking, if I were healthier, would I be able to keep watch over this era for longer? Would I be able to leave more art for posterity? Would I be able to see my friends for longer? Would I be able to voice the thoughts I dare not speak. <sighs> Maybe I'm asking for too much. <laughs> 